I had come up with this as the center of gravity spot and now I'm presently operating right here on this location. That being my envelope. And when we go to the butterfly two wing, that's going to move the center of gravity about an inch and a half farther forward because the difference is eight ounces overall between the two wings. So we've got that CG thing and so I'll expect a nice steep launch. And this is going to be the first launch with the Hobby Lobby two to three meter high start.
out of the sun for us. And that, of course, is still with that never bludgeoning device I've got on the front end there. for that Dutch roll that was going on on that elliptical. strong high start. It's your turn with your big bird now. <laughs> okay. She's running? Yep. Okay, now that I've dialed things in, thanks to my friend one who says, I think you need the CG a little bit more forward, which compared to that elliptical wing, which we're just going to not discuss that. trims on the mechanics so that I could get that dialed in and right now I'm going 15 percent you know five percent click negative and I like its behaviors however we are still going to see what you talked about here Mr. Stackhouse about bludgeoning these poor little Reynolds numbers we are going to do that now Mr. Kite's parachute blossoming. picture other than yep it's time to start over
upper center thinner. Now I got to figure out how to pull that off. And how did I screw up that math on the elliptical wing? We're going to sort that out later. Thank you, Augie, for filming. You bet.